So, you guys clicked on this video because you want a working computer interface in Gorilla Tag. Well, you're in luck because in Gorilla Tag 2024 Spring Update, there is now a working computer interface. As you guys see, it is the Spring Update. But without further ado, let's get straight into the video. All right, so remember the truth. This is what the computer interface looks like. Yes, I finally, after days, weeks, even probably like a month of searching on a working computer interface, I finally found one. See, like, look, it's working fine. I can, I can change my colors, stuff like that. Blah blah blah. You don't see that this. See, you guys don't understand. So first, I'm gonna show you guys what it can do. And like I'm gonna basically showcase it, but if you wanna skip that part and go straight to downloading it, go to this timestamp that I'll put on the screen right now. And yes, so skip to that part if you wanna immediately download it. For the people that stayed, so this is I'm gonna be showcasing the um, computer interface, showing you like the basics and stuff. So this is what it looks like. So on the main part, it's got these options, the game, so if I enter, I go into the game settings, just like the normal stuff, blah, blah, blah. I don't really need to show this. The only really different thing is if you go into color, then obviously you have the Steam version. All right. But then there's also a command line, which I don't know how this works, but you can add commands into the game, which I have no idea how that works. Details is like what your name is what room you're in, stuff like that. The mod stats, look, I, so I, as you guys can see, I have bark mod menu, but if I enter, I don't have it anymore. So I can adjust some of the mods, so that's just some of the mods. The ones that are kind of like bright, kind of like this, unlike these, you can like work, like if I get that here, hit enter, helicopter mod, stuff like that. All right, so let's get into downloading the actual computer interface. All right, so once you guys are on your computer, what you're gonna do is go to my Discord server, link in the description. Once you guys are in my Discord server, you wanna go down to the section computer interface fix. Oh, and by the way, the re my Discord server isn't completely finished, that's why it doesn't have much stuff. And then once you're in it, you're gonna see these three files. You wanna download all three of those. All right, for the sake of this tutorial, sadly, I'm gonna delete my computer interface, but obviously I can put it back. Once you guys actually have it in your, all three in your downloads, you can't just put these in your plugins. What you're going to have to do is click new and click new folder. And this will make a new folder. What you're going to do is name this pretty much anything, but I would recommend naming it computer interface. But since I already have one, I'm going to get rid of this. All right, so once you have it, it should show up like right here or somewhere. And then once you have it, whatever it's named, what you're gonna do is you're gonna click like right at here and highlight all of these. And you're gonna wanna add them to whatever you, the folder you just made was, which will be your computer interface folder. So basically what you did is you made a folder and then you have to add those three downloads to that folder. And then there's your computer interface folder. All you're gonna wanna do now is drag and drop the folder into your plugins. Then there you go should have a working computer interface. Obviously you wanna hit install slash update on MonkeyBot Manager. There you go. All right, so now when you load into Grill Tag, you should have your own working computer interface. See, it's got all the stuff, the game settings, com command line, all that. I made this video in order to help you guys get a working computer interface. So if you have any questions at all with just anything that happened in this video, don't be afraid to comment in the comments because I promise you, I will see the comment and I will help you. And comment down below what other mods you want me to help you with. So make sure you guys like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.